What's up guys, Sleeps here with another episode of My Journey to Ultimate Team, and we're going to start this episode off opening our daily web app gift, which was the silver gift pack. In the last episode, we actually got the pace card, which was something that was worth selling. This time, not so lucky, although we are going to keep the fitness card, and of course, discard the rest. Now, after this, we are going to have a look at our trading from the last episode. You guys would have remembered we traded with Benzema and company. We did sell Benzema there for 65500 We also sold our farm in, and the pace card went for 250 coins. But the problem really lies with this company, who has gone down in price actually tremendously because of all the lightning round packs that have been out. So I'm not really too sure what I'm going to do with them. Hopefully I can list them up later on in the nighttime, maybe wait a few days for so as price rises again. But yeah, we're kind of stuck with that company and we're going to definitely make, him lo make a loss on him. There is no question about that. Anyway, you guys would have seen, we have joined the Foot United Cup. I figured we'd do this now rather than later because... The tournament is only available for a few days, so I figured I'd get my cup run in before it expired, and we are going to take the lead in the first round of this game in the 21st minute. There is Lewandowski finessing it past the keeper at the near post, and Lewandowski is actually going to pick up yet another goal. Very similar finish, finessing it past the keeper at the near post. This guy does make the last 10 minutes a little bit nervy. He has himself a free kick on the edge of the area, actually plays it on the ground, and the deflected effort finds its way into the back of the net, but we managed to hang on to that one goal lead through the last 10 minutes to make sure we advance on to the quarterfinals. Yeah, we move on to the quarterfinals, and of course we do want to win this tournament. There is a 5,000 coin prize, as well as a 25k rare gold pack, and I actually like those packs. They're a lot better than the premium players packs, in my opinion. You get the three rare players, and I don't know, I've gotten some decent cards from those packs in the past, so hopefully we can win this tournament. Our next opponent has a very sweaty front three. He's got Depay. He's actually paying a Barbo at striker, which is the first time I've ever seen anybody do that this year. We do take the lead though Savage his header comes in off the crossbar in the 12th minute giving us an early lead and then for the rest of the game it was pretty much all even and at this point I think this guy had actually put his controller down we're going to tramp it across in the 90th minute to make sure this guy has no chance whatsoever of coming in back or taking this to extra time and Obafami Martins uh, makes it 2-0 so a very good uh, second round as well a clean sheet we've only conceded two, one goal in the last two games I don't know if that's because we're not playing division one players but we're actually doing all right at the back and we're also scoring goals at the front which is what matters so let's hopefully get another result which will obviously put us one step closer to the final which we definitely want to be winning now our next opponent has a 4-3-3 Bundesliga team and he actually has the same exact attack as we do he's got Sherla he's got Lewandowski and Bella Robbie up top although his midfield is definitely better with a uh, Muller Vidal and Gundogan we take the lead though through our own midfield their Chalhanoglu from distance puts it right into the top left hand corner I don't think it could have put been put anywhere more in the corner and he is actually going to take me out in the box I don't know why he's sliding right there once I saw him slide again I just continued dribbling because I knew he was going to trip me up Sherla goes right down the middle I actually forgot to give that to Lewandowski it was just in the heat of the moment I just wanted to take that penalty as quickly as possible to give us the two goal cushion and then here in the 90th minute Bellarabi without a shadow of a doubt puts this game beyond our opponent there's no way he's going to come back We've, we're up 3-0 and and just like that, we are on to the finals with another clean sheet. So we have been showing some excellent form in this tournament. Maybe I need to do more tournaments because we're keeping clean sheets. We're scoring goals. This is exactly what I wish we were doing in Division 1. So here we are in the final. It's all there to be played for. 5K on the line. Rare gold pack on the line. And our next opponent has a team like this. Now, I knew not to underestimate this because if you guys would remember, the last time we were in a final, we barely scraped past. And he had a very similar team to this. This guy took me all the way to penalties but as you guys would have seen he had three bronze players so what do you think he did he brought on Messi Aguero and I actually forget the last player I think it was Di Maria he just brought on an Argentine attack and he definitely was a good player but nowhere near as good as that guy in the final you guys see we're up 2-0 and Chalhanoglu is actually going to pick up a third goal for us making it 3-0 in the 88th minute or in the 89th and there's no way he's going to come back and with that we are champions. So we managed to shut out Messi and Aguero, who he brought up off the bench. We managed to get another clean sheet. We only conceded one goal through the entirety of the tournament. That's excellent team performance, 5,000 coins in the bank, and of course, the rare gold pack that comes with it. So that's all going to go nicely to our coin total. And of course, I know you guys want to see the 25k pack, the rare gold pack, so we're definitely going to be opening that now. We definitely have, obviously, we are guaranteed rare players. Are we going to get anything decent? Let's have a look at what we get. And I see this, and I'm hoping it's 
Gustavo De Gea, but yet again, we get trolled in this series, and it is not. It is actually Iker Casillas, and you guys would have seen, I was actually thinking that these players were going to be non-tradable, but we actually can sell these players, and in a lot of tournaments, you have no choice except to keep them, because they are usually untradable, but those are, so we're going to send everything that's worth selling to the transfer list, sell them on, to obviously help us out with our coins. But that's going to be it for this episode, guys. Next episode is going to be back to business as usual. I just wanted to make sure to get my Foot United Cup run, and we thankfully did win it in the first try. So if you guys did enjoy it, we won the tournament, make sure to leave a like, leave a comment, and subscribe if you haven't already, and I will catch you guys next time. Thanks for watching.